Good, good morning, everyone, and welcome all of you to the third section today, AM section, for the second day of the week of prayer. And today we have a different student, we have a different speaker who shared with us a valuable message this morning. And the person who will be interviewing them are my classmates, Jelin and Abby. So welcome all of you, and thank you for this short interview. Good morning, Brother David. Hello, good morning, good morning. We praise God for the wonderful message that you have shared for us this morning, that you have reminded us about our purpose in our lives and for redirecting our lives back to the path that leads to Jesus. And with that, I would like to ask you our first interview question. Please tell me about your preparations for this year's week of prayer. Um, the, the preparation was really hard. I took a uh, few, uh, one month, I think. And we, we saw, uh, what I can say is, in the preparation is, all that I can say is that we have experienced God's love. That is uh, the most important thing. I, we experience God's love in everything in the preparation, from the writing of this, this the manuscript to the making of the PPT. It's just, we just experience God's love. That's all I can say. Amen, Brother David. It really, God worked through you yes. to inspire us through His message. Good morning, Caleb. Thank you for having you this morning to answer a few questions regarding our week of prayer. So my first question is, what is your reaction about today's topic? Okay, so today's topic is about the purpose why I'm here. Actually, uh, the first time when I've been here, I just want to get an attendance because it's very important for students. But during the week of prayer time, I learned a lot of the knowledge about the Bible. I, I, I know that I still need to improve my spiritual life uh, during this week of prayer. I can learn a lot of knowledge and uh, uh, get an improvement for my spiritual life. Thank you so much. Going back to Brother David, my second question for you would be, how were you able to ensure that the key message was understood and remembered by the congregation? Um, <laughs> I do not know, to be honest, but I do know that the Holy Spirit is working in the hearts and minds of the students. Mm -hmm. uh, the Holy Spirit has been hard at work to, uh, this week of prayer. I know that. I, f I feel that that the Holy Spirit is working in the hearts and minds mm -hmm. of the, uh, the students, and that is the only assurance that I have that they that the message have reached the, the their hearts is through the Holy Spirit. Amen. It's really through the conviction of the Holy Spirit that um, speaks with the students yes, yes. With their, through their hearts and minds. For the next question for you, Brother Caleb, as a student, what values can you learn from the week of prayer? Okay, so as a student, uh, I remember that uh, yesterday, the one of the topic is life is hard. But I wanted to say life is not only hard. We should learn how to rely on God in the, in the hard time. And during the uh, school time, we will have a lot of challenges, such as the assignment, the examination, and the report. We will face that. But the words of the Lord will comfort my heart and will encourage me. For our last question for you today, Brother David, describe the effects of your topic on the students' lives. Um, I think um, after the message, if their hearts have been touched, one thing that I ask them is to ask God to, to let them experience God's love. And I hope and pray that as they leave PIC, that they experience God's love. That is all. Amen. Thank you for encouraging the congregation to ask and experience God's love. And it is truly by the grace of God and through His love that we may be able to share love and express love to others. For the last question, why do you think this topic or earlier topic is relevant for you as a student? Uh, because as a student, we know uh, in our daily life, we still uh, need to pray. Uh, during the week of prayer, we will have many times of the pray, and uh, we will have the reflect and uh, to the God, and we will pray to God. We can during the pray time 
uh, to think a lot of question uh, during our time daily time because in the daily time we are busy uh, we will focus on our school time we will focus on our the other things but during the week of prayer uh, we can focus on the pray and focus on the God, on the Lord Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Wow. You're really good at English, huh? <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.